Three Minute Mastery from Module 3. Here we're going to talk about the thermodynamics of heat pumps. And you know, I mentioned in the last Three Minute Mastery that we can use uh, a heat pump to pump energy uphill. That's a pleasing way to think about things, but what does that really mean? Um, I want to take you back to the last module where we said that heat is an expression of molecular kinetic energy. Well, what we're talking about is the kinetic energy of some molecules generally in a gas. So let's take our atmosphere, the air that we breathe, as an example. So in our atmosphere, turns out that we have a whole bunch of different molecules, but one of them is water. Now, based on the uh, molecular bonds between the hydrogen and oxygen atoms, there is a lot of possible energy to be stored there. There is a potential for a lot of kinetic energy to be stored there, consequently a lot of heat to be stored. So uh, what a heat pump does, because it wants to remove heat from a source, a heat pump will remove the water from the air and move it someplace else, move that heat someplace else, uh, maybe to a, a larger reservoir, the outside or the back of the refrigerator, something like this. A heat pump removes heat by removing water from some enclosed space. So the question I'd like you to think about is air conditioners, say in the backyard or even those ones that mount in your window, they tend to drip water uh, in the middle of the summer. Why is that? 